So here in Moodle, we're going to have a look at how we create a drag and drop image question here. So I'm going to jump into this quiz that we've got set up. We have no questions in here yet. We're just going to create this one drag and drop image question. So we'll click edit quiz and across on the right, we're going to add a new question. And if we scroll down here, we are using the drag and drop onto image question. So we can drag and drop images onto that image or we can drag and drop type onto that image in different drop zones. So we'll click add here. And we're going to call this question label the dinghy. And then we'll scroll down and we're going to add the background image. So this is going to be the image that we're going to drag and drop our type onto into different spots. So we'll pick an image here. And you'll want to make sure your image is scaled down so that it will appear on different devices. I've picked an 800 by 800 image here. So on this monitor, it works pretty well. Be careful with resolutions that are too low, but you don't want very large images, otherwise, they will move off the screen. So basically we have our image here. We can scroll down and then open up our draggable items. And so here we're going to set some draggable text and we'll type in hull. And basically these draggable items work alongside, if we scroll down, the drop zones. So we can select hull from this list. And then if we scroll up, we'll see the word hull will appear at the top left and we can drag that down to where that should be dragged to when the student answers the question. So we'll add a couple more of these, a draggable text, we'll type in keel and then we'll scroll down and select keel from our list here, scroll up and again we can drag keel down here to where it will label that image of the dinghy. So we'll add a couple more here and then we'll go down and modify where they're going to drag to. And you need to make sure you select draggable text, otherwise it won't work. So those all look good. We can scroll down and we'll just select mainsail for this one, jib for this one, and rudder for this one. And then we can scroll up and we'll be able to drag them into the different spots. Okay, so before you label everything, you sometimes might want to save your changes. I'm going to click Save Changes and Continue Editing. And we're also in here on the draggable items. We're going to check this shuffle option, which will shuffle the answers so that they're not always in the same order. So we'll go to Save Changes and we'll jump back to our quiz and we'll attempt the quiz where you can see now we have our words at the bottom. So we can drag them into the right position. We're going to get one or two wrong here, just so that we can see what happens when we make an error with this question. So we'll finish our attempt. We'll submit all and finish. And you can see we've got 0.4 out of one. So basically you can see our answer here is partially correct. So if we go back and start a new preview, you can see now if we pop these all in the right spot and finish the attempt and submit all and finish, you can see we got one out of one. So our grade for this is now perfect. So that's how to create a drag and drop question with an image and text in Moodle. If you do have any questions, then please get in touch.